all right guys uh, today i'm going to show you uh, how to uh, replace a mercedes uh, this is a vapor canister or charcoal canister so guys remove this uh, this uh, inner uh, tire lining and then you remove the tire which is the rear uh, rear passenger and then guys you take a clip from there you take a 10 millimeter uh, plastic uh, bolt from there then you take right from there you take from there and then from there these are like guys like five bolts the plastic ones and then like uh, three uh, three clips the plastic clips guys so right here guys is our charcoal canister so it's just exactly where the uh, where the gas where you fill the gas for the car from so what we do guys first things first guys we disconnect this uh this hose right here which goes on top of this uh canister and then guys uh once that is out we disconnect this uh this small connector going on this uh canister on the side so guys for this case guys have removed this uh this from here and then next guys there's this uh water uh, kind of like a drain inlet from the gas uh connects here there's a plastic thing you take it out of the way so that it gives you guys uh, enough space to pull it out so guys uh, what happens next is guys uh, there are three kind of like hooks behind this canister I'll show you guys when this thing is out so uh, you put your hands down right here and then guys like next below exactly this uh this this hose going through down there just below it just above it you just like you feel some kind of uh kind of like a clip or something so guys you press on it so hard and then guys you try yanking it out and then this thing guys should just uh, come out with ease guys just with ease just try gently so guys when this thing comes out guys uh that right there on the wall guys those are the three places where this thing is going to hook into all right guys so this thing is outside so the whole idea guys is uh you see right here it's locked right here guys it locks inside uh inside the car so what you do guys you don't push it outside you just push it inside like this once you push like that guys this thing just unlocks from the lock and then all the three things guys will just come out you just push them up just just hold it so tight and push it up guys so this thing just comes out without a problem so once it's out guys you can now uh, open this uh you can use uh, anything uh, if the clamps are uh, specific if it's just like uh a phillips you just open if it's just the other kind of clamp you just unlock it and then you pull this thing back out and then guys you put in the new one and then guys you just position these guys one two three on the little thing and then you guys you can lock in so guys, it's just as easy guys to do the work and then uh then you should be having a new canister guys i remove this one so i know another one comes with it so when you buy a new one it normally comes with this one guys so you should be able to be good to go all right i hope this video really helps you out as you fix your charcoal canister of uh, evaporative uh, uh evap uh the system Alright guys, for those guys who want to know the part number, this is a part number right here. It's a 203-470-0659. So if you put that on your uh if you put that guys on your search engine or on the browser, they should be able to bring uh, this part up and then guys should be able to just buy it out. Alright guys, so I hope this video really helps you out. See you in the next video. Alright, alright, please like and subscribe. Alright.